Falcon where they just played around the Orn. They killed, I think it was Whippo like four times. So there you go. Solo is a, a pretty competent Orn pilot. And they round out their team comp with a lot of good team fighting. It feels like whenever Solo were available. Yeah, he's got him on a yo-yo. Hoon came down, so looked like he was going to reset. They dropped Dragon. Now they're oh, actually going. He's the one to go in, gets knocked up upon the entry. And at the Wild Grove, does manage to survive. Speak a chunk down to half HP, but still remains. Immediate retreat. Biofrost teasing us there, able to keep XU alive with the heal and ultimate. But now Dignitas is starting this Dragon out. There were a lot of ultimates committed by both teams. Only Ari ult up for the side of TSM. And without a way to start that fight being delayed. Hopefully you're on this Rift Herald push, we get it. Killing someone, the key to Mark's happiness. Getting a Rift Herald charge onto the mid turret. That's one way to put some smiles on the faces of TSM and the fans alike able to finish it. Oh gosh, sounded like the character in a book that I can't remember now. So. Game of Thrones, House of the Dragon, here we go! Hey, let's go for it! Who will get locked down down first? For TSM. See if any plays are made right now as TSM keep their eyes on this Rift Herald. Dignitas on the approach, go in for the knockup. A charm lands onto one, followed up with the root. But Hoon, the subject once again by the wild growth. Blue flashes away. Follow up knockup on to Hoon, leads to his death once more in the center of it all. XU still remains until TSM has something to say about it. Another flash plus. Oh, the charm immediately after, answered by the stasis of Biofrost, but it's not enough. The nope Mid was. Grab some more gold in their pocket, up to a 5,000 gold lead, just over 16 minutes into the game, looking really having good. Having so many voices, so having Solo, who's willing to go mute, can for sure be a benefit. Stoic. Mullet wearing. And really work on that leadership being so important from the support position as TSM does go in here, gets knocked up by one. The follow up, no, oh no, they lose Spica. Rely upon those fundamentals. You have to stand your ground at some point as Spica might go over the wall here and try and pick a fight. Looking for it on to Biofrost. Knock up and more. Has to wild growth onto himself before flashing away. Teleport coming in in a supportive style for Dignitas. But the Orn Horn goes strong. The responsive Orn Horn from Blue's side. See if they can link it on back. But the charm directly onto Hoon has to flash away. All of these flashes. It's all in the jungle. Look at this. Distraction. Look at these. All these wards down there. That is actually super important for what's to come. Uh, or Solo trying to set it up right now. A direct isolation of Biofrost on the side ends up giving his own life for X. Bon and Blue are going to try to contest because if they don't, the game's basically over. But with no smite, you have to somehow win a 3v5. All right, let's hear how TSM is taking on this play. I stun, I stun. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Strength That's right. Really actually turn off the Baron, be able to find that easy kill in the Hoon. And exactly as you were noting, having that mid lane so prioritized to crack open by TSM, the advanced warding leading into that play after taking down the enemy jungler. Now wearing that purple with the Red Bull Baron buff, they bring that power to the bot lane. A wave ushered in both of the mid lane and the bot lane are where they'll be focusing their sights right now, burning this one down. Yep, inhibitor gonna be dropping next in the mid lane while Solo gets the bot side set up. Spica crushing that one, having a monster game again at 5-1-1, one, and one, despite that one. If they can take down the second one here, TSM, Dignitas, all in the vicinity. Once this turret goes down, it gives them an opening blue, going into stasis nice and early. Hoon, wild growth, and flash away from him. Double knock up Solo into the back line. Instinct is getting mighty low, though, but they take down the pig herself before he can make an impact. The knockups continue with all that TSM has at their skill availability. This is a 5v3 currently in time they're gonna keep up the pressure supers coming into the base because of the time that had passed since they took that inhib spawn looking to try and make the play the burst fire and beyond xu into the back gets the heartbreaker takes uh -oh. over orin himself spika into stasis he goes so low on the hp falls two of tsm battle between him and the dragon but first we gotta listen in on how that team fight went down Inner turret does give some angles for TSM to wrap around behind them. You can see them have to be very careful. All right, going for it. Quite the burn down onto Instinct here. As soon as out of stasis, Blue eliminated Instinct with the kill credit. Hoon's been hovering over that wall side to see if he can find a point of entry, but they can't because look at all those minions coming into the base. The opening is here for TSM. Full team in effect. Can they make it happen? But the lockdown uh -oh. on the Spica is too good. You gotta be worried about those resets that they're coming through from XU. Another roof onto him, though, is answered by Maple, putting TSM on 
to the forefront, but in the end, they came from the voices when we've gotten to hear them, especially Spika wanting to hit that go button time and time again, even in these moments. But they retake down that mid inhibitor. Okay, we should really fight. Let's go around, go around. Yeah, yeah, they're solo. Look, 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 yeah, yeah. Let me. Just go around, go around. Silver, go now. Silver, go now. Silver, go now. Look, look at Sedge here. Sedge. Yeah, look at me, look at me. Oh, he doesn't have jump. Look at him. Keep going, keep going. Keep going. I'm looking. Yeah, Lulu I'm going. Lulu got back. knocked up. Lulu got knocked up. Yo, Kerr's there. Oh, no flash, no flash. Look at me, look at me. Vigo, Vigo. This guy's grief. I'm going. I'm going. Wait, Lulu, oh, I got him. I want to kill Bio Frost. Can we kill Bio Frost? Where the fuck did he go? Can we end? Can we end? Can we end, bros? What the fuck? I need to <laughs> we all knew it was a potential with the live comms. Yep. I, I also love the, I want to kill Biofrost. Can I kill Biofrost? It's kind of a little personal fair. or something. Yeah. I'm not quite sure. Maybe there was some secret smack talk behind the stage. I got to say, sick hook by Chime, grabbing Hoon out of his queue over the wall, making sure they find that first kill, remove the front line of Ding Toss so they can try and snowball through the game. TSM are ready for this time. Three members here. A charm onto blue. A stopwatch hit. A hook onto one. Taking down the biggest threat on Dignitas. TSM should feel the vibration of the fans starting to rejoice, trying to see if they can make these pushes in the final moments of the regular season. Get as many kills as you can, TSM. Set yourself up and sink that one down. You heard the TSM chants right at the 